Hey YouTube, the Broke Kareem of here. I wanted to share with you my top picks for my books that I'm reading right now. As far as this whole quarantine lockdown thing, you know, four four billion people on this planet under lockdown, 97% of the United States. Also, the same thing happening. And in case you're brand new to my channel, I'm a merchant cash advance broker, 21 years old, that at 19 years old just started uh, his merchant cash advance company and did about uh, within 14 to 16 months did about 350,000 uh, in revenue within the first 16 months. You know, compare that to a real estate agent, which the average salary or the average what average real estate agents make is according to Indeed is about 84, 85,000 a year. And so my my company we generate about 350,000 in 16 months. So a little over a little over a year. The first book that I actually just finished reading for a second or third time, I think it was the second time I ever read this book. Uh, it's it was the War of Art, and I think it's actually personally one of my favorite books. Uh, it talks about procrastination, and you know about how uh, anytime you you try to have a creative endeavor or a, an entrepreneurial adventure, uh, typically you're gonna have you're gonna face some form of resistance, which is resistance is uh, personified. Uh, kind of treated like a like a person and it's basically standing over your shoulder Preventing you from doing the things that actually might do you good in the future. That's my that's my summary. That's my uh, synopsis of it uh, I hope I, I, I did the, the book some justice, but it's it's a really good book I uh, encourage you to read it. You know, it talks about addictions habits um, Just everything everything and then um, how it relates to work. So really good book I really recommend it and I just finished reading it I give it a 10 out of 10. There's a coach by the name of Marie Forleo. She says this is her favorite book. So I thought that was pretty interesting. I found that out after I read the book. And then once I found out that that was her favorite book, I had to read it again. Um, and I was not disappointed. By the way, I'm going to put all the links in the, in the description for all these books that I'm going to be talking about in the video. I personally like reading my, my stuff on audiobook. Uh, I prefer listening to, to my books rather than uh, reading them. But if you want, the links are in the description for all of these. Another book that I just finished reading, or I might have fallen asleep while I was reading it. I can't really remember. But it was the the one thing I just I just finished reading that book. I think this is my second time reading it as well. Um, and you know, it, it basically talks about how um, you know you get big companies, great companies, typically focus on one thing, one product, one service. And um, I I you know I was never. I never was really consciously thinking about this, but I'm looking back into what what we did for my company. I realized that most of uh, you know the the eighty twenty rule, whatever. But basically, the eighty twenty for us was the merchant cash advance thing. A lot of our, you know, a lot of our business owners were getting on the merchant cash advance product versus any other product that we had. Another thing I don't I don't really mess with is that real estate stuff. Um, you know, part of the reason for that is just that. That's how it was trained. That's how I was trained. That's how it was taught to me. Um, that the that the real estate takes a, a really long time, a lot longer than the different products that we offer. For example, you know we could get fund, we could get a business owner funded relatively quickly if it makes sense. The next two books that I'm going to mention are not books that I'm currently reading right now, but I still recommend them for you to check them out. Just because I, I agree with some of the ideas and I think the info uh, is very is very good um, or very you know powerful, empowering. Uh, however you want to call it uh, and one of those books is, is the the millionaire booklet by Grant Cardone okay I think this is a very short book I think it's like only like 50 pages or something like that um, it's very short but uh, very simple very simply simply written you know you don't have to uh, have a college education to read this book um, but you know it, it basically it's basically just simplifies it to to the extreme you know the book is only 40 50 pages or something I'm trying to find out how many pages it actually is, but it's actually very, it's a very short book. Um, I think the audio book is only like an hour long or something like that. I mean, it's, it's, it's pretty, pretty, even though it's simple, um, I think it's, I think it, the ideas are pretty good in it. Um, so check it out if you're interested in, um, in wealth and trying to, trying to become rich, I guess. <laughs> okay. Salespeople. The next book I highly recommend for you to check out is, uh, the Jordan Belfort way of the wolf. You know, you may have seen him in the movie Wolf of Wall Street. Uh, but he actually has a book, and it's and it's really really informative on, on sales. Probably one of the most comprehensive guides I've written on sales. You know, they talk about uh, the straight line system and about 
um, tonalities and stuff. I mean, it's just crazy high next level stuff. Um, you know, I, I know that uh, Grant Cardone and Jordan Belfort just had a feud recently. And uh, who, who's the better sales guy? Who's the better, you know, finance guy? But I mean, uh, I think I think both of them have good stuff to say. And I don't think both of them have to necessarily interfere with each other. I think both of their ideas are really good, um, especially if you work in sales. I think this is a uh, re- really good stuff. Okay, and the last book I'm going to mention on this list, and this may this may seem a little bit weird, okay? Uh, but I'm just going to share it with you guys anyway. The, the, the last book that I'm reading right now, uh, that I'm currently trying to read, is uh, it's a book called YouTube Secrets, okay? YouTube Secrets, why YouTube Secrets? I mean, uh, you know, I, I, I am making videos here on YouTube. Uh, you guys are watching this on YouTube, right? Um, you know, if I'm making videos for YouTube, I might as well try to get good at it. Might as well try to bring the most high quality content to you guys, um, and you know, look look for uh, things that I can help you because you know, after all, the channel is called the Money Guy, which is which basically means I'm trying to get you some money. Speaking of money, hit that link in the description for Webull, where you could get two free stocks up to fourteen hundred dollars value when you deposit a hundred bucks. The account is free, it takes a few minutes to set up, and boom. You get your notification that you got your two free stocks, okay? They are going to ask you for your social security number. That's normal with any account that you open, whether it's a bank account or a brokerage account. They're going to ask you for your social. Uh, so just, you know, but it's free stocks. It's, it's, you know, you can literally cash out after you get those two free stocks. And also, if you're interested in joining me in what I do, which is uh, Merchant Cash Advance Broker, Business Loan Broker, uh, go and hit the link description. It's called Richie.ai, Richie.ai. Use my special promo code, coupon code, for a discount, I think we're gonna end that discount pretty soon. Either today, today probably when you're seeing this video, we're probably gonna end that discount code today. Um, just because you know we're moving on with the channel. Um, you know it's good helping out uh, my 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 friend, but you know we're gonna move on. And uh, you know basically what what you get is you get a lender list, a CRM, and also there was one other thing you get. Um, oh, and a website. How could I forget the website? Okay, they build you your own website. Uh, where you can get start getting your applications in, and yeah, I think it only costs like only hundred bucks, and then with my promo code, you get a, an even steeper discount. Um, so sign up for that. Uh, but yeah, like I said, I'm, I'm probably not gonna be uh, talking about them anymore. I'm promoting them anymore. Um, so if you guys want, get on that. Uh, but that promo code does expire today. And yeah, that's it for the video. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, subscribe to the channel. We're the number one Merchant Cash Advance information channel here on YouTube, okay? I don't think there's anyone on YouTube that's putting out more information about this industry than me, okay? Um, So I appreciate you guys watching. I'll talk to you soon. Thanks. Peace. And uh, one more thing, one more thing before I forget, which is... Hold on. I'm going to show it to you right now. Hit the like button. Hey! It's in my face. Hit it. Hit it. All right, peace.